We are here today to celebrate the sacred union of Kai and Makina, and there's no other place to do this than right here in the House of Heaven. I have been blessed to call McKenna one of my greatest friends since the fourth grade. We have spent almost every milestone in life together. First communion, dance recitals, birthday parties, our goofy backyard photo shoots, confirmation, high school, and even college graduation. And I could not be happier to stand by her side as she celebrates marrying the love of her life. Kyle is very good at life. He loves what he does for a living. He doesn't dwell on things. He appreciates what he has. He's a strong follower in the Catholic faith, and he stands up for what he believes in. Dearest Kyle, the day has come, the day I get to walk down the aisle and marry you, my best friend. I get to commit my life and love to you forever. Since that first day I met you, I knew there was something special. Dear McKenna, Words can't describe how happy I am that our day is finally here. I just wanted to say that I've been blessed to have McKenna as a daughter. A gift from God, truly. Been honored to be her father. To have Kyle as a son-in-law, that's just as good as it gets. The faith they have and the love they have for each other, it doesn't get any better than that. And with that, they can accomplish anything. So may God bless him with safety, happiness, and love forever. Kyle and McKenna, they really, they're just uh, a true example of where and what, in my mind, where a married couple should be. So Kyle and McKenna, long and happy, blessed marriage to you. We have come rejoicing into the house of the Lord for this celebration, dear brothers and sisters. And now we stand with Kyle and McKenna on the day they intend to form an, a home of their own. Marriage is not just a contract, it is so much more than that. It is a sacrament, it is a covenant with them, it is a sacred covenant. So your soon-to-be spouse, your soon-to-be husband, and your soon-to-be wife is a present, a gift from God that He's given to you to show you once again, to give you another proof of how much He cares for you. The happiness of your marriage will depend on how much you are willing to do this, how much you are willing to sacrifice yourself for your spouse, the greatest joy of all would be if someday you can say to each other, I can thank you that with your help I have attained eternal life. I can't wait to see you walk down the aisle. I can't wait to say our vows. I can't wait to have our first dance as husband and wife. I promise going into our marriage and life together that I will love you as you deserve to be loved unconditionally and without end. You are my one true love and I thank you for inviting me into your life and asking me to spend the rest of my life with you. I can't wait to start our forever. Dearly beloved, you have come together into the house of the church so that in the presence of the church's minister and the community, your intention to enter into marriage may be strengthened by the Lord with a sacred seal. Makena, do you take Kyle for your lawful husband? Kyle, do you take Makena for your lawful wife to have and to hold from this day forward for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish until death do you part? I do. When McKenna first 
first mentioned Kyle to me, I knew he meant a lot to her. And then when she asked me if I would join them for line dancing, I thought, wow, a man who wants to dance. I have to see this. And I'll just tell you, Kyle was very impressive. After that evening, I knew Kyle was special. And then there's McKenna. When Kyle first started talking about this girl from Fenimore, he was so into her. He kept, he talked about her all the time. It wasn't long after I met her that I found out what he was after. This young woman up here, she's just as beautiful on the inside as she is on the out. She's also a strong follower in the Catholic faith. She's kind, she's sweet, and she's a lot of fun. She fits in our family like she's been with us all along. And we just have not been the same since. Kyle has not been the same since. Kenna, you, you are the reason this guy turned out all right. A few of the things that I believe make McKenna and Kyle so great are that their relationship is built on an incredible friendship and they share something so very important, their faith. I hope you continue to share your great love with others all the days of your life. McKenna and Kyle, I want nothing but happiness for you both. As individuals, I have nothing but respect for their character and the way they choose to live their lives. And as a couple, I'm truly inspired by the strength and the foundation of their relationship. And if you'd have told me that 10 years ago that when I get older, I would actually look up to him, I would have said, you're nuts. <laughs> and if you'd have told me 10 years ago that when I get older, he was gonna be your best friend, I said, no way. <sighs> but he is, and I look up to him <laughs> more than he'll ever know. <laughs> I look up to him more than he'll ever know. They, they truly have found the one. And I hope you guys remember that if you have that, you have everything. I can't wait to spend every day with you, and I can't wait to see what, where life takes us. I love you more, Kyle. I choose you. I'll choose you over and over. Without pause, without a doubt, in a heartbeat, I'll keep choosing you. I will love and honor you all the days of my life. Becoming your wife will be the best moment of my life. I love you with all my heart and more forever. You know, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Richard.